Tyler Nielsen. From the moment he arrived, you could sense he was destined to have a special career at a place held so near and dear to his heart, rich in tradition and legacy, began by his mom and dad, who graduated from the forest as he would look to preserve that tradition of excellence. Tyler Nielsen short-handed nails the empty net. That should seal the deal here tonight against St. Mary's. 2-0, his first career goal. Welcome to the forest, Tyler Nielsen. Well, my parents went here, my, my dad played hockey for two years and then, and then coached here and then my mom swam here. Um, my brother also goes here, so you know, a bit of a family affair here and, and a lot of history and a lot of people when you walk around that uh, my parents knew when they were here and that are still here while me and my brother go here. So, um, you know, it means a lot. Um, honestly, <laughs> when I was going through the recruiting process of coming here, uh, it was one of the things that uh, actually started to steer me away from coming here, um, was that both my parents came here. But um, the more I looked into it and the more I, I went through the process and we came out here and you know, talked to all the people that were here and, and met a lot of the guys that are here and um, the community that they created. Um, it was the perfect fit. Um, I remember coming here as a kid, um, being out here for tournaments in Chicago and you know, meeting up with, with my dad's old coach, Coach Fritz, who um, is still comes to a lot of games today and um, is like a second father to me, um, second father to my dad. So. Uh, it, it was great, you know, having him around and, and being able to come to games and you know seeing what he means to this place and, and what he meant to the hockey program is, is uh, truly special. I've been a member of their family in kind of a strange way, but in a great way. We've become, become very close, and I have watched the boys grow from little people to the young adults that they are now. As an example, when Matt um, and Laura had the boys, they got them involved in hockey. And every, almost every year, the boys would be in some kind of a tournament as mites, squirts, peewees on up. So I saw them play, and then Tyler went on further, and he decided, you know, I played juniors and decided he was gonna become a player. And I was kept abreast of all of this. I saw him play almost at every level, at least once a year. And uh, Matt uh, became a good coach so we learned from, from Ken Klein, who was my assistant at the time running our JV program, which we had back in the day. And he learned his coaching material from Ken. They were really close friends and still are close friends as we all are. So it really becomes a family affair rather than just knowing hockey people. And uh, it was really fun to watch the boys develop into men. And uh, here we are. And it's just been a terrific time for me to be involved with them. Tyler Nielsen has been an impact player for us the past four seasons. His first year was a shortened season due to COVID, but right away we knew Tyler would be a valuable player for the program in years to come. Sullivan on his backhand. Here comes Tyler Nielsen flying through the left wing side, cutting to the middle from his left to his right, lets the shot go and scores. Tyler Nielsen in overtime. And the Foresters throw the final punch here tonight in Fond du Lac, 4-3 over Marion. First of all, I just want to say thank you for, for welcoming me in. Um, coming in as a freshman from another country. Obviously not easy, but uh, from the moment I got here, you made a, made a transition and made an impact on, on my life. And obviously the past two years has, has been amazing being able to be around you so much and spend a lot of time together, which has been great. Um, and then obviously you and I get to be line mates for two years. I think that was something that worked out very well for both of us. Uh, I had a ton of fun playing with you and I think we did we did some amazing things together as a, as a, as a team. Ross, who gets the pass from Nielsen and scores. Lake Forest draws first blood in the border battle. An excellent job off the rush. Nicholson fell Nielsen straight ahead. And then all he had to do was deliver it to Justin Ross, the first year skater of Calgary, Alberta is on the scoreboard and it's 1-0 Lake Forest. 
Hello and welcome to the Alumni Memorial Fieldhouse on a night all about celebrating the legacy and tradition of Forrester men's hockey on this Peter Taylor Award night. A lot to look forward to here. The Foresters are in their home whites, the red outline, the black numbers. They will skate from right to left. And the Dubuque Spartans in their road blues with the white numbers and the white trim, they attack left to right. The Tyler Nielsen line to start. And that one is cleared into the neutral zone as they lift it out. Tyler Nielsen down the right wing side, crashing into the zone. Bella strikes, ring the bell. Colin Bella buries it that time on the feed from Tyler Nielsen. One nothing for the host. Established by Peter's family, friends and teammates to celebrate his life and continue his memory. The Taylor Award is presented annually to the Forster selected by his teammates whose outstanding talent, leadership, and love for the game best exemplify the qualities that Peter possessed. The 2024 Peter Taylor Award winner, number 21, Tyler Nielsen. It is Tyler Nielsen. Very well deserved, sir. His dad, Matt Nielsen, a former Forester, onto the ice. Pretty special moment. He set up that first goal of the game. What a fitting moment. That is the current team Ironman is Tyler Nielsen. The accolades continuing to pile up. A two-time NCHA All-Academic Team honoree. He currently co-leads the team in goals with 10 on the year. He is a leader in power play strikes this year. Four, he has the only team shorthanded goal with one. Special teams, yeah, he's active there, but certainly special player is number 21. Tyler Nielsen, he wears that logo. It means a lot to his family. His parents both went here. And again, he certainly exemplifies what Peter Taylor was in the brilliant career he had here. All right, we'll uh, award the three stars of the season. We normally do it for a game, but uh, for the Foresters and the season. The final one, the number one, goes to the Peter Taylor Award winner, the team Ironman. 81 consecutive games to close out his Forrester career. That goes to Tyler Nielsen. He embodies everything that this men's hockey program, and it's all about you talking about building culture. He does all of that and then more. Touches it back for Tyler Nielsen. Two on two. Tyler Nielsen shooting and scores. Far down for Tyler Nielsen. Money is Tyler Nielsen on the kill. Oh, my. Yeah, Tyler Nielsen, son of uh, another hockey alumni, Matt Nielsen. Um, and Ty's out here looking for some generational glory tonight with both goals.